What's up, you guys? My name is Mary. I'm with High Priestess Intuition. Welcome, my current subscribers, and welcome, 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 newbies. If you guys are new to my channel um, and you enjoy my content, you can smash that sub button to be notified for future readings. Thanks for all the new subscribers and love and support to the channel. It's growing so much. Thanks for all the love and support, sharing all my so uh, my channel on social media and word of mouth. I very much appreciate it. It's helping my channel grow. Uh, for people that don't know about my channel and etc. 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 So I love it, you guys. Thank you. All right, so the downloads are just flying in, so we're just going to keep doing it, just saying, just saying. Love you guys so much. I do. Okay, so the channel message I received was, um, an Aquarius I heard is get, uh, about to get a huge ass wake up call. I heard they have been watching and watching and watching and watching a particular situation, and they're about to get a huge ass wake up call some a positive wake up call some a negative wake up call so you plug it in how it resonates whatever situation they've been watching and how that resonates and applies but i heard i heard they've been heavily watching the situation so some kind of aquarius energy masculine type aquarius they can have aquarius in any aspects of their charts some moon rising venus ortho and have jupiter charts but they have been very heavily watching a situation very heavily watching it um they're about to get a huge ass wake up call about it whatever the situation is and how that resonates so um how that resonates let's see i'm gonna try to find a wake up call energy now uh, it makes me wonder why the hell they're heavily watching a situation just saying just saying i mean why are, why are they heavily watching <laughs> unless they want to know how it turns out or something going on with it hope it's not stalking energy i didn't hear it was but they're very heavily watching that's for damn sure one of the, there's two Aquariuses in here though. One's about to get a positive wake up call. One's about to get a negative wake up call. Confirmation with the lightning. I feel for some of you guys, it rain might be significant or a thunderstorm or lightning might be significant because thunder just occurred, lightning occurred before that, and it's raining here. So it might be raining in your area, thunderstorming, thunderstorming in your area. You might be seeing lightning or hearing thunder or or something of that nature. Thunder. Wake up call. Last card in the deck. For one Aquarius, it's about to cause a huge fire to be lit in their ass. One, they're about to be so embarrassed. So embarrassed. Okay, I heard for one Aquarius, it's about to cause them to get a huge ass wake up, uh, positive fire lit under their ass. And for one, they're about to be so embarrassed. So whatever the situation is that they're highly watching in some shape, form, or fashion, um, only this Aquarius, these Aquariuses know what situation they're highly, highly, like, glued to the seat of their damn pants watching, I guess. I don't know why the hell they're watching it, but um, one, they're, one's going to get a positive wake-up call, one's going to get a negative wake-up call, but one's going to get a very positive fire lit under their ass, one, they're about to be embarrassed. So wake up call, whether it's positive, negative, embarrassment, or um, uh, a positive fire lit under their ass. How that resonates and applies. The shit is about to get so real. The shit is about to get so real is what I heard. The shit's about to get so real. Well, we are hashtag real talk on here. Always have been. So shit's about to start getting real. Maybe for these Aquariuses or for this situation. Conf double deuces. That's lightning again. Double confirmation for lightning in this reading. Just saying, just saying. Shit's about to get real. Um, but y'all know I'm real talking on here. That's just the truth. Always have for two and a half years. Thunder times two. Ooh. Spirit messages you have reflected. I heard take it, Everless. I heard take it, grounding reversed. Okay. We have earth magic reverse, effortless, upright, grounding reverse. Thunder times three. 
triple confirmation in this reading. Whoa. And it hasn't been doing this all day. It just started about 45 minutes ago, maybe 30 minutes ago, something like that. Earth Magic Reverse. One Aquarius is about to find out someone is on cocaine. Very heavy. A significant drug test in a workplace is about to become very significant. For one, a, C a request of a CPS drug, drug screening. For one, it's one it's cocaine. For one, it's meth. Oh, heavy cocaine and meth energy in here. They got drugs. Okay, so drugs. So um, a a Aquarius is about to find out somebody's on cocaine or meth. Methamphetamine. So cocaine or methamphetamine. Um, it's obvious, I don't think it's the, the Aquarius on the, um, uh, cocaine or methamphetamine, but somebody else is, meth, um, either through their workplace, some kind of workplace screening sounds upcoming for, um, that's going to expose them on co cocaine or methamphetamine or, um, or something else. For one, it's marijuana. And they live in a state that does not support it. For one, it's marijuana, and they live in a state that does not support it. Conf three times confirmation with lightning, four times for thunder. Holy crap. It's about to cause some chaos and conflict. Because the thing is, is okay, if you work in a workplace, and I heard the place that marijuana, the state doesn't support the marijuana usage. So... You can't walk around smoking a reefer uh, or a joint or a blunt per your state, like the rules and regulations of your state, because your state doesn't support it. Some states support, like you can grow your own shit in the backyard, you can um, buy it on the street, but some states don't, like Alabama. Alabama does not support it, period, point blank, except med medicinally. So like when I work like as a nurse out in the 3D, I've given it to patients before because it's supported medicinally here in Alabama, but not any other way. You can't purchase it recreation, recreationally, basically. So for some, it's cocaine. For some, it's meth. For some, it's um, uh, marijuana. But they're either about to be exposed through a child protective service, about to ask them to take a drug screening, which they can refuse to do that and get a lawyer and lawyer up for that through Child Protective Services, or they can accept to take it through Child Protective Services. Workplace, they have to take the drug screening because they agree to be an employee at the workplace. So, but somehow they're about to be exposed, whether they agree to take the drug screening and they know they've been doing drugs through Child Protective Services, or they lawyer up and somehow they still have to take the drug screening. I don't know. I mean, I've had many child protective service visits for me personally in the past, but I've never been on drugs. I've asked them if they wanted me to take the drug screening. They said no. So, I mean, just saying, just saying. But however that works with having a lawyer up with child protective service with drugs is what I'm trying to say. Because I've never had a lawyer up with child protective services with drugs before. And that's just the truth. Uh, but some, I mean, I didn't hear this person was going to lawyer up, but somehow they're about to be exposed, whether it's through Child Protective Service requesting a drug screening or um, uh, workplace. And I know workplace, if you agree and consent to be an employee at that company or companies, anytime they do a random drug screening, you have to take it. And that's just damn true. So whether it's coke, meth, or um, marijuana that's not supported in a state that doesn't support marijuana, recreational marijuana. Somehow an Aquarius is about to get a positive or negative wake-up call somehow relating to drugs, uh, and somebody else is about to be busted. I think it's an earth sign in some shape, form, or fashion, because uh, we have earth magic reverse. I think it's an earth sign about to get busted. For some, it's an earth sign. For some, it's a water sign. For some, it's an air sign. For some, it's a fire sign. Okay, so all signs. So all signs on the board. So 
there's a lot of people about to be busted for drug usage, whether it's in a company, random drug screening in a company, or child protective service about to request to um, a child protective service call, which creates a series of chain of events, and the worker, social worker, requests them to take a uh, screening. Now, they can choose the lawyer up with the child protective service um, um, situation or not. Um, but if they take it and they flunk it and they have kids, that doesn't look good on their ass. I, I'm, the kids are going to be removed or they should be removed from the home. That's the damn truth. That's the damn truth. So I heard all signs here. Earth sign, air sign, water sign, and um, fire sign. Aries, Leo, Sag, Taurus, Capricorn, Virgo, Gemini, Libra, Aquarius, and um, Cancer, Pisces, Scorpio. Some of these people are very high statured in their community. They are about to go downhill in a huge way. They have been hiding this for many years. Some of these people are very high statured in their community. High professions. Respected professions. High professions, respected professions. Some of these people are very high respected professions so they make a lot of money so they can afford the drugs, basically. Because if you're poor and you're living underneath the Poverty line, how the hell are you going to uh, support a coke habit or a meth habit or even a marijuana habit? And that's the damn truth because you don't have the money to pay for it. And that's the truth. So these people, might, they're very highly respected professions in their community. Very highly, um, um, they make a lot of money so they can support their drug habits, whoever they are. And I heard they've been hiding it for years. One of them, they work in the government and they're about to be mortified as hell. They've been working in the government a long time. One, they work in the government. So that could be city, local, or state government. I mean, I'm not city. I'm sorry. It could be city. City or local, which could be city. Local, state, or federal government. I heard they've been working in the government a long time. So they've had their job um, for a long time, whether they work in the government or some other high profession. And they've been doing these drugs, it sounds like, for a long-ass time. But they, in all fairness, they've had the money to support their drug habit. Like I said, if you live under the poverty line, how the hell are you going to support a very expensive drug, ha drug habit? And that's just damn true, because you can't. So, they're about to be unstable, ungrounded, unreliable, and dependable because their ass is about, well, some of them are about to lose their jobs because it's about to be random drug screening in their job, um, they're in place of employment. They're corporate conglomerate i didn't hear corporate conglomerate but i feel for some they do because they work in very high professions so feeling corporate conglomerate for some of them um they're about to be unstable ungrounded unreliable independent um because they're about to lose their job their money their access to buy drugs for some their parents because cps is about to get involved another confirmation with the lightning Effortless. Another confirmation with the thunder. This is about to start happening fast. And per policies and procedures, they will not be able to get around this. And these Aquariuses need to hear this. Some Aquariuses will be happy about this. They have tipped people off about this. Some, they're trying to hide it. Okay, I heard uh, per policies and procedures, these people will not be able to get around it. So we are pulling in all signs here. So whatever signs resonate with your story. For one of you Aquariuses, you've been tipping people off about suspected drug use, I think, in your workplace. For some, it could be you made child, maybe for one, you made a child protective service report on somebody for suspected drug use. However, that resonates you for some. Oh, hold on one second, you guys. Hold on one second. Hold on.
Okay, so sorry. Okay, so my neighbor decided uh, she's leaving. She got a plane ticket tonight, actually. So that was actually Lyft coming to pick her up. So I was trying to figure out what was going on. So I apologize about that, but um, that was Lyft coming to pick up my roommate. So she is getting a plane ticket tonight, and she's going to be going tonight. So, okay. So sorry. <laughs> it is raining out there. Okay. Okay. So I heard from one of you guys, you have been tipping people off about the drug usage, drug usage basically. You've been tipping them off. Uh, for one, you've been hiding it. So, but it's about to go effortlessly. And I heard they're going to have to follow the policies and procedures. And yeah, they have to. They have to follow the policies and procedures of the facility or work site or corporate conglomerate or whatever that is. And that's just the truth. Especially when it comes to drugs. It should be when it comes to anything. But I've seen people that break rules left and right, left and right. Go with drugs. Uh-uh. Nay, nay, man. That's not cool. Because what happens if they work around people? And they end up harming people because they're so hopped up on damn drugs. And I heard these people have been doing it for years. And one of these people works for the government. Now, the government is very, that's right, broad. You could work for the police. You could work for the city. You could work federal. You could work local. You could work state. The government is very large encompassing. And that's just the truth. This is about to go fast. This is about to go fast. So effortless. It's about to go fast. And not going to take mercy on these people. And not going to take mercy on these people. And not going to take mercy on these people. And you shouldn't. Drugs doesn't ever benefit anybody except for the dealers and their pocketbooks. If you might need to hear that. Grounding reverse. And Aquarius was trying very, very, very hard and others to keep a Leo feminine in the dark. But the mini series chain of events, she's about not to be. She's already gotten wake up calls. She's really about not to be in the dark. And Aquarius and others need to hear this. Okay, so some Aquarius and others were trying to keep confirmation. So she might, the Leo, if you're the Leo feminine in this aspect, you might receive a phone call, text, confirmation, email. Something to do with your phone, possibly. That's confirmation. But you plug it in how it resonates. But some kind of Aquarius energy, masculine or feminine, um, and others, I heard, have been strategically trying to keep you in the dark about a situation. But I heard you've already got intuitive spikes and some kind of confirmations previous of some, something, whatever it is for you, Leo, Leo Femme. You could be um, Leo at any aspect. You're charged in your Femme energy. But I heard soon you're about to really find out what really is going on so you've already suspected something or had somebody tell you something that jived with what you thought in the past if that makes sense but so like upcoming in the universe you're really about to find out the juice basically about to find out the tea so and it's about to make so some people so upset because they know they strategically had it hit it in the past and it's about to make some people so upset because they they know they strategically hit it in the past. So grounding reverse is about to make some people unstable, ungrounded, unreliable, undependable because they know they um, hit it in the past. Grounding reversed. Well, that's what you get for lying. And that's just damn true. All right, let me see if I hear anything else. For one, your child is about to tell you huge information, huge information. For one, it's a community member. For one, it's a company you're about to start working in. For one, uh, Leo Fem. Leo Fem. Okay, so Leo Fem, if this resonates for you. For one of you guys, a child is about to tell you. Um, your child or somebody you're connected to's child. Somebody's child, whether it's your child or somebody you're connected to's child, about to tell you the huge information upcoming. For one, it's a community member. I'm assuming in your community or somebody else's community about to tell you. For one, it is um, 
somebody in a company you're about to start working in, I'm about to tell you, some kind of information that you already had intuitive spikes about or some information about on the past, but not all of it. Not near all of it. It's going to lead to a lawsuit and you will be very successful. Okay, I heard not near all of it. So you knew you know some information on the past, but not all of it. But whatever either your child or somebody you're connected to child about to tell you, somebody in your community or somebody outside your community is about to tell you, or somebody uh, that works in a company you're about to start working in is about to tell you, it's about to be life altering, ground altering, and it's gonna lead to a lawsuit. And I heard you will be successful. So good for you, Leo Fem. All right, I love you guys so much. Everybody have a wonderful choice, uh, wonderful choice, wonderful day, and I will stay.